Yes, it's a very patchy picture. Evidence. It's hard to say who's responsible. We don't know where the perpetrator actually is. The Kurdistan regional government and security forces have not released a statement yet. The only statement we have is from the Turkish foreign ministry confirming at least one fatality, uh, the deputy vice consul to the consulate. Uh, at the moment, it's unclear. And the point that your other speakers have made is that Erbil is an incredibly safe part of Iraq. Uh, attacks in recent years have been very few and far between, mostly claimed by the Islamic State. Last year, there was a shooting at the governorate building. Uh, in 2015, a bombing near the US consulate. But attacks like this, shooting incidents targeting particularly diplomats, are incredibly rare here. And it will be interesting to see how this influences the relationship between Erbil and Ankara.